I don't feel like talking about myself. This is a time of many crises in India. The crisis of terror, the crisis of fear. There's an agrarian crisis in the country, a very serious crisis affecting farmers. So I really don't feel like talking about myself. But since facts are facts, political sequences are sequences, I am grateful to the 18 parties now in the opposition who have very unanimously, unitedly and without any uh, difference of opinion in the discussions asked me to be the candidate for the vice presidential election. I feel honored that they should think of me in this context because they are thinking of a name for the election to the president and the election to the vice president at a time when the country is facing many problems. Most of all the problem of confidence which in uh, Tamil is this simple Nambikai. The erosion of Nambikai in institutions among communities Nambikai in leadership. This is that kind of a time. So I am very grateful to the parties for having thought of me. I just want to say very quickly how I see myself. I see myself as a citizen candidate not as a political person because I am not a political person. I am not in any party and I represent no parties though opposition parties are fielding me. I do not belong to any of them. I am an independent person. I am an independent citizen. I would say a very ordinary citizen. I see myself as a citizen candidate who is worried about the future of our country as a collective entity in this critical time but who also has faith who has faith in the institutions of democracy, who has faith in the judiciary, who has faith in the independent media, but more than anything else, who has faith in the common sense of the people of India. That is all I wish to say. And I would like to say, members of parliament who are the electoral college for the vice presidentship and partly for the presidentship, should choose the Vice President with a view to making the Rajya Sabha a true instrument as it was in the times past and as it has been over the years, a true instrument for voicing the views and the feelings of the states of India. It is called the Council of the States and that is what I see the role of the Vice President as Chairman of the Rajya Sabha.